about my dreams. What the hell? Didn't expect that, but love so extreme, like a spell creeping up my back. Was drawn to your glow, Aurora. Since I first seen you, but little did I know you're sorta from where I've been through. It felt so unreal. Every sec, every sec we spent together, we heal from the wreck, from the wreck. We and when you are with me, those moments are really precious. Just two stars we be. leader in high definition. Gay fucking shit. Good evening, I'm Van Tu. You may Good have gay. seen our newest reporter, AJ, on NBC North Dakota News, and he'll be joining the weekend news team as my co-anchor. Tell us a little bit about yourself, AJ. Um, thanks, Van. I'm very excited. I graduated from West Virginia University, and I'm used to, um, you know, from being from the East Coast. So, someone called us. We got multiple calls about you. What? About something pertaining on the beach. Yes. Were you what? supposed to be, were you doing something you weren't supposed to be doing? What? Like, what, what were you doing on the beach? 
like prior to coming here. Prior to coming here. There was nobody. I was just sitting on my town. Nobody was around me. Okay, and you were over at the beach. Like I was, I was near the water. Near the water. Yeah. Okay. What did I do? What did I do? So apparently you were masturbating on the beach. <laughs> Who saw that? I mean, a couple people. No, they families. didn't. That's that's not true. Why would they call us? Nobody, nobody was around. It was it an anonymous call? Is yeah. this one of my buddies? Okay, no, one of my buddies. No, it's, it's not one of your buddies. It's, it's a family. Okay, look, let me sh no, right, let me show you what I did. Okay. Okay. Is there anything I'm... in the bag? No. Because right, if I look through it, I mean, if you can open it and can I see the contents inside the bag? Yes. Okay. I don't know. I don't really understand what y'all are. We're, I... we're just here because someone called and we're this very is concerned. Now. Okay. This is really highly offensive to me. I got it. I got you. And that's why I'm trying to figure it's it a, out. It's my yeah. vibrator, but I just put it in my... I was sitting on the beach and I just... Just okay. okay. Do I need? Do I get a ticket? <laughs> so, so you, you did have a vibrator. I, listen, I was sitting on the water like this, and I just put it in there, and it was covered up, and I just had an orgasm. I'm sorry, I was stressed out. I Is got that you. Okay, just hang tight for me. I'm sorry, nobody saw me. I was in the okay. water. Okay, so what, if that's, this is anonymous, call I mean, if nobody saw them, they wouldn't have called, right? Call if nobody saw it. Man, please so. don't do this to me. Are you serious? A family saw it. They had kids. They, what? Are you, there was called. nobody around me. So. It's a bullet style. That's what they call it. Oh my Jesus. Now you're going through it. You're logging everything. <laughs> She admitted to it, and she, you know, she said she had an orgasm on the beach and all that other good mess. Okay, early to bed, early to rise makes a woman healthy, wealthy, and wise. That's why you're wiser than me. It's Stephen. Hi, I'm Maurice. I'm an executive by day and a wild man by night. Hi, my name is Monroe. Uh, you've probably already noticed that I have incredibly blue eyes. Hi, my name is Phil. Uh, most of my friends call me Big Phil. Okay, um, I like to talk to people uh, deep into the night. I play guitar. I'm Eitan. Hi, I'm Fred. Hi, my name's Mike, and if you're sitting there watching this tape smoking your cigarette, well, hit the fast-forward button, because I don't smoke and I don't like people who do smoke. I'm not afraid to get sand on my tuxedo if you're not afraid to let the wind mess your hair up a little bit when I take the top down. Perhaps even a, a nice bath with some champagne and candles. Hi, Mom. Um, I do fashion photography, and I do consider myself a refined valley dude. Okay, I'm looking for a trendy girl with a simple smile. Wait, it says here, oh, excuse me. I don't know, what I'm not looking for is uh, some big overgrown monster that's always thinking about food and... Whoso binds to himself a joy, doth its winged life destroy. Um, I like to uh, do a lot of sailing, I like to outdoor activities, I like climbing, I like travel. I took a sponge ball and <clears throat> was pulling him out of a little girl's ear. Vivacious, foxy. I'm looking for the goddess. Are you the goddess? Who is the goddess? The goddess is the woman, is a woman, is any woman, is all women. A figure that is sexy, slim, tight, excellent legs. Mm. I'm a 25-year subscriber to both Playboy and a New Yorker magazine. At night I operate a damsel in distress hotline. I guess you'd call me a knight. Uh, one of my favorite foods is pizza. And just... Sugar and spice and all those things that are nice. I like to be with people who are, who are as fun and adventuresome as well. Is into having fun. Have fun. I enjoy having fun, yes. Looking for somebody who, has, who likes to have a lot of fun. I'm looking for someone to have fun with. I uh, love to have a good time. Uh, able to have fun. Uh, fun and laughter. And anything that's fun, I like to have fun. And, uh, and have a lot of fun. Are you looking for me? 
No fatties. Uh, I want it all. No hamsters. I steal watches. No dopers, no smokers, no alcoholics. We don't like to write checks. No Donna Juanitas. We don't like to take out the garbage. No posers. What I'm doing right now is making a movie about World War II. No crazies. Santa Monica and my front porch swing. I'm currently involved in cleaning up toxic waste. I'm not having fun doing this. Do you like cats? Domestic violence. I, I like to wear bright socks, and I'm an avid Cleveland, Cleveland Browns fan. Sexual abuse. Life is a playground, and I want somebody to play with. All sorts of alcoholics and addicts and stuff. Because I really have a zany sense of humor. We probably don't like to clean the house. Uh, my mother still writes to me regularly. Because I average about four hours a night's sleep. I will cry at a commercial. I'm interested in most phases of data processing. Fire-breathing dragons. Type A, I'm not. Comfortable, caring, and serious about a relationship, I am. I'm, I'm really looking for somebody I can feel special about. And I don't encounter people like that very often. And I'm hoping you're one of them. Are you that woman? Please give me a call. And you know that a journey always begins with the first step. And I hope that if you like what I'm trying to say, or you'd like to know more about me, to please write.
has become the night of your breakthrough and the resistance is now gone. So flow freely into the blessing that I have placed upon you, saith the Lord. Receive the gift of faith. Receive the gift of faith. See it done. See it done. He's showing you that building built right now. He's showing you your child saved right now. He's showing you freedom from that addiction right now. Oh God, oh God. Pray in the Holy Ghost, pray in the Holy Ghost, pray in the Holy Ghost. Shout, I have received the gift of faith. Get him up. Get him up. Get him up. I preached this whole night to get right here. Get him up. Get him up. Come here, Mike. Come here, Mike. Get him up here. I, I preached all night to get right here. Pray in the Holy Ghost. 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 Get him right there. Get him right there. Get him right there. Shout! You know it's done. You know it's done. You see it done. You're going home and you'll never hear of it again. The cloud will lift, the blockage will go, and I'll give back to you everything the enemy tried to steal. I only wanted to see if you'd praise me in the middle of the fire. You're in the fire now and here comes freedom for the ropes are burning off of you now. They're burning off of you now. I'm going into that situation. I'm breaking it loose. I want everybody. I'm going to put more power in your words than was ever in your hands. You're going to deal a deadening blow to the forces of darkness. Whenever you walk down the city street, just open up your mouth. I'm reminded now, I'm reminded now, I'm reminded now. Prostitutes are going to come out of houses of ill repute. Drug addicts are going to drop their syringes. They won't even know why. They won't even know it was you. And you'll never know about it till you get to heaven. But just know, saith the Lord, that at your word, you command the works of my hands. So loose me, saith the Lord, and I shall do exploits.
Hi, I'm Elizabeth, and I live in the West End Pretend Valley. Pardon me. Hi, <laughs> I'm Jana. I'm looking for... I'm not sure. Hello, my name is Ellen. Some people call me sexy. Others say I'm sensuous. Hi, I'm Linda. <laughs> well, you know, when I'm not using my doctor in pharmacy to troubleshoot a large healthcare computer system, I'm over at the gym pumping iron or driving my black Porsche with the wind blowing through my hair and, and singing along with Anita Baker's Rapture of Love. I guess you could say I'm an Oreo cookie freak. I have an Oreo cookie jar, Oreo salt and pepper shakers. I like to collect anything with an Oreo on it. And I love to eat double stuffed ones. They're the best. Bette Midler. I laugh hysterically at Bette Midler. Um, I have two cats. And I don't know how to ride a horse. And my goal in life is to have my own religion. I was a flop at canoeing. I'm looking for a romanticist. Spend time at the fireplace. Someone that's clean. Be clean, you know. I keep my car very clean, and I expect a man to do the same. And I also like very meaty men. One who is charming, personable, doesn't smoke in my face. I am looking for a passionate yet permanent romance within the guidelines of safe dating practices. Well, I gotta go now, but keep in touch, okay? Bye. That's it. <laughs> You have a very good point, though. There, there are a lot of Latinos here in this country that do agree that the immigration problem is a problem, and it does need to be addressed, and it does need to be fixed. Interesting. But making uh, those comments, those racist comments, do not help. And, it does, and if, yeah. you, if you kick every Latino out of this country, then who is going to be cleaning your toilet, Donald Trump? Oh, that's... No. In the sense that... No. You know what I mean? Like, no. when I'm saying there's that... More, there's more jobs to be... In L.A., they, they always... But, but, but they Latinos don't, are not only the no, only people No, I didn't mean it like that. that. Come on. No, I would never no, mean it like that. Okay. okay. I'm not part of this argument. Uh, with Hi. Uh, you're, you're neither male nor female, right? That's true. I identify as non-binary, right. which means I'm neither male nor female, and but correspondent to that, I use the they, them pronoun. However, the idea that you're saying that if this person chooses to say that they are they, that you can't engage with that because of your belief system, we live in a culture where lots of people have lots of different beliefs, as is very, very clear on today's show. We, we cannot say, I have this belief system, so therefore I'm going to impose it on everyone. In this, you, you can't do that. Like, she has a particular... has gone on, like the story of the 10-year-old rape victim in Ohio that a lot of conservatives said was made up, right? It's not possible that a 10-year-old was raped and had to go to Indiana to get an abortion. Lo and behold, it did happen. Who raped yeah. her? Yeah, who was, who was that? Is this a, oh, an undocumented man did. Yeah. yeah. Let's close that border. Yeah, exactly. Uh, <laughs> Finally. Hey, Thank you. Don't God be so silly. Do you think it really matters? No, it actually happens all the time. It's it underground illegal immigration Guys, black market because people refuse to close the border. Americans yes. rape women, too. We can all agree on that, right? So this happened to have been someone who was undocumented. Equity. <laughs> Guys. No, but you, point, what, you, point my, is, you my, bring up this example. When you bring up this example, the consequences are these yep. points. Hi, I'm Gary at the one and only Gary's Mattress. Now with locations in Koreatown and Little Tokyo. We are karate are chopping the prices. I just Good for you. Ah, chop. Even we would buy it. At Gary's Mattress, we're blowing up prices. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man on horse, bring gold. For treatment at Gary's Mattress, I'd be very surprised. We're scalping prices. If you find a mattress at a better price, I'll kick a puppy and punch a kitten just for you. We got to celebrate our differences. We got to celebrate our differences. Ooga booga doo, ooga 
Bugato. We got to celebrate our differences. Nacho taco, chimichanga. Cause it's beautiful when the whole world sings together. Raise the chimichanga. Brad first Matt, I didn't think we'd get along, but turns out we kind of agree on everything. Your, Your racial, racial identity is the most important thing. thing. Everything, everything should be looked at through the lens of race. race. Jinx, you owe me a Coke. Damn. We both have a lot of opinions about people of color, even though we barely know any. I say colored people, but as long as we're classifying them, we both think minorities are a united group who think the same and act the same. And vote the same. You don't want to lose your black card. Sorry, I don't know. I just think we should roll, roll back, back discrimination laws so we can hire based on race again. again. Jinx, now you owe me a Coke. Hey, tell them what you told me yesterday. White actors should only do voices for white cartoon characters. Been saying that for years. Stick to your own. Us white people, we have so much privilege. I agree. It is a privilege to be white. Ask him about interracial dating. All I said is that black men who date white women have internalized racism, and white men that date ethnic women are fetishizing them. Guys against interracial dating now. Like, am I being pranked? Did Boomer put you up to this? Ugh, you know that taco place is white owned? White people should be making white foods like Kraft macaroni and cheese, no seasoning, not even salt. It's like he's a mind reader. I mean, I've been pushing for segregation forever and my man does what? I created an improv comedy show exclusively for ethnic people. Guy segregates comedy on my birthday. White people need to stop wearing dreadlocks and they need to stop appropriating black people's music. Shaved heads and country music, the way God intended. You know all white people are racist. I'm listening. Even if you have a black wife or a black friend group, you're still really racist. You know, he just kicked a guy out of the organization for having a black girlfriend, but if you can promise me he's still really racist, we'll consider letting him back in. Black, black people should only shop at black, black businesses. businesses. I guess the only thing we really disagree about is I think white people are the root of all evil. But what did I tell you, though? If we can narrow that down to a certain group of tiny-hatted white people, I think we can come to an understanding. Technically, I don't consider Jewish people white Neither do I. First came Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, and Super Mario Brothers, and now the ultimate retro nostalgia throwback game. I present to the world Alex Jones's New World Order Wars. They're turning the friggin' frogs game. I'll eat your ass, you Nazi scum. Let's free the Patriots and defeat the globalist tech. We are going to defeat the globalists very bigly. This game is mostly peaceful. Woo! Ah! Mm, I'm going to lower the world's population. <laughs> oh, big deal. I'm taking you down, rapist. I did not have sexual relations with that saxophone. I cannot believe he's out here again. He's a street performer. He's waving down vehicles. Then uh, he was a problem last time, so let's go out on him. One time on a BMA will be on the boulevard. Come over here for a minute, man. Come here. Air one. Come, stop. Get up, get up. Oh. Get up, walk. What are you doing? Dude, I'm trying to make some money, man. Stop right there. Relax a minute. What are you doing? Man. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down off of them. Get down, dude, off the pole. What are you doing, bro? Come here. Walk to the car. Walk to the car. Stand here in front of the car. Stand there right there in front of the car. Oh. Give me the parking lot to the rear of the building and a white pop when you playing loud music and drinking. Get up. Good. Good. Get back in front of the car. I need you people to help me. Get back in front of the car. Get back in front of the car. I don't want to go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, officer. I'm sorry. Stay right there. Put your hand. Stand up straight. What is wrong with you? Man. I apologize, but I'm trying to make money. You know, 
the last time we met. I stopped you a few weeks ago. I went to jail for that. Okay. I don't bet for anything. You see those tourists out there? You see them, they love me. And I try to make honest dollars, and I try to make it the best way I know how, and I don't want problems. I can break these cuffs. You can't break those cuffs. Ah! Do me a favor, stand up straight at the car, please. Take a deep breath, it'll be all right. Take a deep breath. I think I have an idea what to do with you. Hold on. Hey, Sergeant Reyes, if you remember last week, I told you about that tussle. Well, this is the individual again. He's waving down cars in traffic, but I told him he's either going to end up in prison, being incarcerated, or I know an establishment down there that employs little people. And maybe that might be better to solve it that way and get him a job. Yeah, why don't you take that job we got for you, man? If you could give me a job, I, 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 Serge, I swear, I wouldn't be out here on these streets. I wouldn't I wouldn't be out here on these streets. I don't want to be out here on well, these streets. What are you intimidating character? I can tell you that right now. Okay. All right, come on. Thank you. All right. All right, Dave, we're going to go down there. All right, I'll follow you. One Mary one. One Mary one. Most talented guy right here in the world. We told him maybe we can get him a, uh, a job. Hey. The owner's coming over in a second. Yeah. I'm gonna What's, up, What's up, man? How you doing, man? How are you? Oh, yeah, bro. How you doing? Yeah. He's going to take your handcuffs off. Yeah, man. I'm going to take these off, right, Dave? You know what? I... This is the owner. You got to impress him. Let's make it or break it, Dave. Go for it. I think you'd be a good addition to your business. That's the only place I know that employs little so people. Where, are you really homeless? Like homeless homeless? Yeah. They need some help, man. Maybe you guys yeah. come up. You guys make plenty of money over there, right? They love me. They loving me right now. He's talented. The guy's really talented. Good job. So you think you can hire him? Yeah. Or should he come back tomorrow? Or? Nah, I'll be here. I'll be here. So Dave, Dave, they're gonna fight. They're gonna give you a job. You're gonna be back here Thursday night at 11 p.m. Awesome, on time. All Mr. Right, Beach will be nice enough to with you. Finally, word an email from Nick to address. He says, first, I'm a big fan of WGN News, accurate, professional, and timely. What I am not a fan of is Anchor saying thank you to every reporter after every report. Yeah, I'm not a fan of oh, that. Oh, brother. Uh, please stop thanking reporters. Yeah. It's their job. Yeah, it yeah. is their job. Just move on and start reading the next right. story. We as viewers cannot care if yeah. anchors feel the need to be over polite to field reporters. <laughs> well, Nick, we agree and we fix the problem. That's the latest live from Wrigley. Nancy Lou, WGN News. Nancy, thank you, parishioners at a suburban <laughs> 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 Kelly Davis, WGN News. Kelly, thank you, Chicago police. They're live all morning long from Lollapalooza here in Grant Park. All right, Dean, thank you. That does it for us this morning. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, guys, how's that? Kelly yeah. Davis, WGN News. Here's the complaint. 30, other side. I'm okay. That was not as hot as I thought it would be. Okay, I'm okay. Ow. Oh my God. I set the whole way alarm on. You're kidding. Okay, hold up. My steak. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, oh fuck, 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 fuck. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. I don't know what to do, guys, I don't know what to do. Shit. Help, 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 help. I don't know what to do, you guys. Guys, I don't know what to do. Help, help. Fuck, fuck, I don't have a fire extinguisher, fuck. Shit, shit, shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know what to do! Help! Help! I need a fire extinguisher! I need to put this out! I, I don't know what to do! 
help me, please. I need help. Oh my God. I put it out, I put it out, I put it out, I put it out, I put it out. We're okay. Third title reign, Scott, 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 no! No, wait a minute, he's not gonna put you yes. in the recliner. Yeah, give it oh, no, no, oh, no, no, Dave, we're out of time. Smash, smash.